So hello and welcome to a new weekly vlog. I actually didn't vlog last week and so this morning I completely forgot I was supposed to be vlogging. It is now half past two. Um, so this morning I got up, I kind of, oh, I got up a little bit late. It was like nine o'clock, but I slept for like 10 hours. So that is quite late really. Um, I got up, did my makeup. I actually quite like how I've done my makeup today. I filmed first impressions on this guy, which I've been meaning to do for quite a while. It's this Maybelline contour highlight stick. It went really badly, messed up my makeup, so it's a first impressions fail, I'm going to call it. And, um, yes, yeah, so I did that, and then I did an hour of maths, um, because obviously I'm now having to, just through the pen, I've done an hour of core one. Or well, I did a bit over, it was about an hour. I did some at work yesterday, and yeah, so I've obviously got a day off today. So I did some of that, and I've just been editing a weekly vlog. I might actually be nearly up to date now with the vlogs. I feel like this is the last one I've got before. I'm not quite sure, I need to check my diary. But yeah, I've got that. I'm going for an interview. Well, it's not really an interview, it's more of like a chat with my mum um, at half four for a new job mum and I might be doing it's like we're just basically cleaning holiday cottages it's like a I don't, I don't really know we just manage and clean like a holiday cottage through this agency but it, it's not going to be like my job it's going to be mum's or and my, probably Hannah's and I'm just going to like help out when they need me um, I'm going with mum's because I need to practice driving this hire car that we've got because mum's mum's car which is going to be my car soon because I'm buying it off her is um it got hit by a drunk driver about two three months ago and so it needed the whole door being taken off and replaced to, well, because it, was, it wasn't our fault, so it needs a whole new door. So to do that, they had to take the car in for, I think it's going to be a week, it's going to be gone by, so I should get the car back on Thursday. At the earliest, it'll be Thursday, no. At the latest, it should be Thursday? I'm not sure, it's around Thursday. So we've got a higher car, and it's this blue Nissan Note, and it's a brand new car, and it's really nice, but I really hate driving it. Um, So yeah, I need to practice driving it as well. Um, Because tonight I'm going shopping with... Um, Matt's cousin Lucy who you've never seen before I don't know if I'll really film anything it's like a student night thing or something I think she said it's like oh, I don't know but yeah we're going out shopping um, Matt left for university on Saturday I feel like I need to just like lay down and like chat to you guys so Matt left for university on Saturday and I have been pretty close to an emotional wreck ever since no, I'm joking it was really hard like the first two days basically Saturday and Sunday I just said goodbye to him on Friday cried a lot but um I cried my, I kind of held myself together pretty well I would say um it's just difficult being like nothing for me has changed apart from that he's not there do you know what I mean so it's like for me I, I keep being go, going to do things and then he's not there it's like whereas him I'm sure he's missing me well I hope he is but like not as much because it's all new for him so I'm not normally there I don't know like spending Saturday night by myself was quite weird like because we'd normally do stuff so yeah but I don't know I'm gonna go visit him at some point. Um, he's not too far away. It's a it's a train journey. I could drive, but it's cheaper to get the train actually because once you paid for parking, that wasn't actually very comfortable. Once you've like paid for parking and stuff, it's ended up being just cheaper to get the train. Um, but yeah, you guys don't need to know any of that. I'm just like rambling now. Um, my room's a bit of a mess. I've been filming some stuff for the brand. I work. I can actually tell you about that now. I think it's an app called Bomo. B O M O. Um. I don't know how, somehow they're like, it's normally, it's, it's a bag, but it's an app about handbags at the moment, but I'm making videos for them on like just other clothes and they're gradually integrating that to the app, just like anything. So I, I go online or any of the clothes that I own, I get clothes, make a little video talking about it, showing what it's like on and then send it back to them. I've, I don't really know where it is on the app, to be honest. I'm not the most clued up about it, but that's what I'm doing if I say I'm like working with a brand sort of thing. And so, yeah. That's what's been happening so far this morning. Really long clip. I'm now just editing a vlog, as I said. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna probably do some, I'll probably take the dog for a walk, do some more maths, and then I'm going out with mum, and then I'm going out with Lucy. So, hello. Obviously, the last clip you would have just seen is me having my really nutritious KFC dinner. So um, obviously I've been a bit of a bad, bad vlogger. As I said earlier, I was getting shopping with Lucy and um, I did that. I'll show you what I got in a minute. I didn't buy too much. It was like a student night, so we got loads of discounts. I actually met a really lovely viewer. Her name was Lara. Lara, if you're watching, hi. Um, yeah, which was really weird because I was not expecting it at all. I was just like, 
shop at like Lucy was paying and then so this like girl was just like hi I watch your video I was like hang on <laughs> did you just say you watch my videos like it's really weird I don't I never meet people who watch my videos so yeah that was quite nice so yeah anyway I'll just show you what I got I'll start off I got this top it was from Primark I don't really buy a lot of clothes from Primark at the moment um I kind of just wanted a really loose um grey t-shirt this is a bit like tighter than I thought it was going to be and I'm not sure about these like stringy bits like I thought that they'd look quite good but I feel like the way that they've been stitched on it doesn't really work but I don't know anyway I'll show you the rest of the things that I got so yeah first things first I got these shoes from New Look they are from the comfort range and um, I basically bought them to try them on because I got these boots from New Look as well the other day and um, they're really comfortable because I really like the heel height except this bit here is really really tight but um they're still really really comfy and these are quite casual and I wanted something that heel height that I could wear out in the evening because it's such a comfortable height like it it's not too high at all I mean actually they are a little bit higher that's three and a half inches so those are probably like what three and three quarters something like that um but yeah these are actually from the comfort range as well so they've got loads of padding in and they just tie up like that and I just thought they'd be really nice it's just like some shoes I know I can wear out and not worry about my feet hurting because I've got a lot of really useful shoes at the moment but they're all seem to kill my feet so yeah I got those and they were well they would be 29.99 but I got 20% off student discount so that was a pretty good deal I went into boots and um it was spend 25 pounds and get a free goodie bag spent 25 pounds and then they told me that they didn't have any goodie bags left so I was really annoyed um but yeah so I picked up these two which I'm gonna do a first impressions on I have already swatched them in the back of my hand, but they are literally the exact same colour as they are in the tube. So these are the Colour Drama, they're like some intense lip paint things. I kind of thought you'd be able to mix them at first, but now I'm not really sure if that's what you can do. It was buy one get one half price, so I picked up two. I picked up this lightest kind of nudie colour and this deep dark purple, because I thought that way I'd be able to mix them. But I'm, I'm going to experiment and do a first impressions, like I said. Um, they're okay from swatching them, they're very bright, they're just, I'm not really sure what the point is at the moment um it was just basically all it said on the sign was that it's like really intense color so yeah it does that but I'm not really sure what the point is at the moment um from NYX I picked up one of these NYX liquid suede in it's a cream lipstick I've heard quite a lot about these at the moment I got it in shade four which I can't remember what the name of it was um but yeah it's like a brownie pinky brown it doesn't look quite true to color in this lighting but it's actually quite an unusual brown it's quite pinky which is why I quite liked it because I'm not really sure I'm ready for the whole like the color that's showing up on camera yet but um I want to get into some more brownie toned lipstick so I thought I'd try that and also this packaging is like really weird I feel like that it's really big tube I don't know if you get that much in it though what's how much do you get in I can't remember but yeah got that also from NYX I picked up this red lip liner in some shade which I can't remember what shade it was basically to match the lipstick I'm wearing right now where's the shade where's the shade where's the shade ruby number nine ruby yeah because I didn't have a lip liner that matched what I'm wearing now so I wanted to pick up that because I really like the lipstick I'm wearing at the moment it's by sleek um then I went to bourgeois because I actually don't own anything from bourgeois and um I thought since I was trying to spend £25, I'd just get it anyway. And I've heard that these are really good. These are the Rouge Edition Velvet like lip things. I don't know, it's the matte one. So I picked up this shade, which again, I was really, really excited about. It's Boo Brown number 12. I don't know. But yeah, I picked up that. I thought it was really, really pretty. Again, it's, doing, it's showing up much more brown on camera than it really is. And it was a buy one, get one half price. So I picked up this Bourjois Happy Light Matte... Um, serum primer because I'm going to do a first impressions on this as well um so yeah I thought I'd try something out because my benefit um matte rescue is running a little bit low so I need to find something else that's a little bit cheaper as an alternative so I thought I'd give this a go so hello and welcome to Wednesday I didn't vlog yesterday did I vlog Monday yes I did I vlogged a little bit on Monday I didn't vlog yesterday because basically nothing happened I um went to work I came home from work and oh actually what did happen this was kind of why I didn't vlog when I got home my laptop isn't working it won't connect to wi-fi and so I'm trying to like get everything off it so that we can do like a um a proper reset of it and try and make it work but I don't think it's gonna work it's five and a, no, it's five years old this Christmas and um I have used it well so I don't think it's gonna work but dad seems pretty confident so yeah, I've just gotten back from work, I've got my comfy clothes on, I've got my whole lot of hoodie, my Gap jogging bottoms, which I basically have been living in. 
and um i'm just watching it's really difficult not to say like well she is still sprinkle of glitter but you know the whole like louise pentland thing she still te she still comes up as sprinkle of glitter on my youtube app on my tv but i don't know if she's changed her name to like louise pentland i, I don't know but yeah sprinkle of glitter i'm watching her lush halloween demos because i was kind of bored and well it wasn't really cool i just I'm so tired, we were really busy at work today and it wasn't supposed to be a busy day, it was supposed to be like a nice quiet day. <sighs> and actually, I just want to go- oh, so I woke up an hour early today. Who does that? Like, I woke up an hour before my alarm and like, sometimes like I wake up and I am like wide awake and that was what happened this morning. I woke up and then there was just no point in me even trying to go back to sleep because I was so, so wide awake, it was just not going to happen. Good morning, I am- um, I'm just getting up, I, I just got up and I- I don't know why I can't start this vlog. I'm going to work this morning, that's what I'm trying to say. I've got my new NYX liquid suede lipstick on, I can't remember what the shade is, I feel like it's number four. I think it's number four. Kind of screwed up the application, but I'm going to work, I just wanted to like test it out and see what it was like. Um, I'm going to try my new smoothie mix from Curl today, this is the breakfast one, it's a mix of banana, blueberries, strawberries, yoghurt and oats. So I'm going to give that a go. I'm leaving to work in like 25 minutes. So yeah. Apparently these are already pre-packaged. So that should be pretty good. It's got four packs in it. I think it was 2.25. Um, but yeah. How do you... I don't know. This is Greek yogurt style. It looks pretty cool. So I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. And yeah. I went a little bit overboard with my makeup today considering I'm going to work. <laughs> okay. So this, this is what the pack looks like. Kind of weird. I think... Well, obviously that's banana. I think this is yogurt, like frozen discs of yogurt. It just says to mix it with apple juice, but I don't have any apple juice, so I'm going to mix it with some orange juice. Um, also this is coconut water. I keep meaning to get some. I always forget. I really want to try some coconut water. But yeah, you get four packs in there. So let's do it. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I made a bit of a mess with the orange juice. Um, I put a little bit too much orange juice in because I only had a carton, um, like a little carton, and that was 200 ml, so I just added the whole thing. Well, bar what I lost. Um, but yeah, I like the colour. It looks quite bitty still, but I guess we'll just have to see. Um, yeah. So I think it tastes all right. Um, not amazing. You can kind of taste the oats in it, which isn't a bad thing, but like it, it's not my favourite smoothie I've ever made. I'm not actually the biggest fan of putting blueberries in smoothies, I think. Um, I think they are generally better without them. So yeah. But otherwise, I think it's quite cool, it's in the pack, really super easy to make, so it's a thumbs up from me. So hello, I am back from work, and guys, this lipstick, I'm obsessed with it, I'm absolutely obsessed with it. It is, I don't know if I showed you earlier, it is the NYX um, Liquid Suede Lipstick in shade number 4, what's it actually called? Soft Spoken my new favourite. I've kind of reapplied it throughout the day, quite dodgy, because like, I only have my little mirror, but um obsessed with this so I just ordered like pretty much every other shade I thought I might like and um I just realized that my sister already has one she has the shade vintage which I've just ordered um so yeah that's both of them look like swatched <sighs> they are so so nice I prefer them so much more than the soft matte lip creams they are just like they just feel nicer they last a lot longer and the shades I think are a little bit better actually I think the soft matte lip creams are a little bit like I don't know, they're not quite so like up to date and trendy, like you don't really get this kind of a shade from that if you know what I mean, like this is quite a brown toned pinky colour, but yeah. Anyway, I was going to film a video, but then I was like, I don't really know what to film. Um, I think I just wanted to film because I liked my lipstick. So yeah, I need to get changed out my work clothes. I was just rushing to buy um, the lipsticks from Boots, but it turns out I had until 7, I thought I had until 6, so I like rushed to buy them. I also ordered some of the Vivid Brights um, liquid eyeliners, although... I couldn't figure out which shades they were, I just like bought them off their names. So I've got the blue one and the purple one, I'm hoping, because I thought that'd be really cool to kind of... Oh no, I've just dragged the hair bands through the lipstick. <laughs> That's great, I've now got loads of lipstick on my hair bands, so I now can't use those. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd try and do like a cool get ready thing tomorrow, because I'm not working. So, good morning. I'm actually filming with my phone in the other hand, so I don't know if this is going to be the right way up or not. It should flip it, but sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, I am on my day off. I have already gotten up, had breakfast. It's 11 o'clock-ish. I've just done an hour of maths because I'm feeling really productive. And I've currently got a little friend just sat here like, stroke me, stroke me. So, yeah. 
Say hi to the vlog. No, not to me. Say hi to the vlog. Hi. She's probably going to freak out if I say hi again. She'll be like, is there someone here? Is there someone I should know about? Is someone come round? Is someone come round? Is it the postman? No, I was joking. It's not the postman. So yeah, my day is pretty chill to be honest. I mean, I've not really got any major plans. I've got a boots order to go and deliver. I don't know if I said I impulse... I impulse bought like every shade of the NYX liquid suede lipsticks that I thought I might like because I got that one that I really loved yesterday. The day I got it on Monday and I tried it out yesterday and I was obsessed with it. So I just bought all of them. I haven't done my makeup yet because well, I thought if I'm going to do maths work and stuff I quite often like lean on my hand and stuff and like I don't know I just thought I'd give my skin a breather for a little bit. Um, I want to do some makeup in a minute. I don't want to film and get ready with me because I've got like one still not that I haven't uploaded and stuff so I don't really want to like bombard you all with get ready with me. Um, and it also keeps raining every now and then and I can't really film when it rains because you just get this background noise of the rain because of the way my room is, you know, the windows are like that so you can hear it like banging on the windows. But yeah, mum and dad are actually going away this weekend so it's just me, Hannah and the dog. So yeah, it's going to be weird. Matt's actually gone on a field trip today from university to near where we live. How bizarre is that? Like they take them right back to where we live. So he's off on that and um, I think he might come visit next week. Or I might go visit him, we're not really sure. But um, yeah, so I've got two days off. Gonna get some filming done. I'm gonna do another hour of maths today, try and finish the whole of, I'm doing call one at the moment, so I'm trying. I'm gonna try and finish. I've done like the first unit, I'm gonna try and finish the second unit. Well, the dogs just ran back upstairs. Um, I'm gonna try and get that done, film some videos, edit some videos. My laptop's not working. Can't remember if I said it won't connect to Wi-Fi. And it's not fixed itself yet, so I don't know what's going to happen. Dad's going to try and fix it. He's quite good with like techie stuff, but I think I need a new laptop. But I don't really want to buy one at the moment because I've got to pay for my car insurance very soon, so I'll end up being pretty skint again, which is not good. So yeah, I'll just have to see. I might, I probably, I have enough money to buy one if I really need one, but I'm going to have to just use the home PC, which is actually quite good that my parents are going away this weekend because it means no one else will be trying to use it. So. I've got it to myself so and also it's quite fast it's quite a beasty computer so I can get editing done much quicker um and luckily I have everything on my hard drive anyway I like had started copying everything across before my laptop decided to really like become suicidal so I've got all of my footage I've got all of the like projects I'd already started editing everything's got I've got everything so it's not really a big deal but it's an inconvenience Okay, so it's much later now, and um, I went out, I went into town, picked up my boots all, I put some makeup on, although my lipstick looks horrendous and I couldn't be bothered to touch it up because I'm going to take it off and do a lip swatch video. So that's why I'm not filming my face. But yeah, I just wanted to quickly mention that um, I, because I'm getting my car, my own car now, and mum's getting a new car and I'm having her car and buying off her, blah, 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 basically I needed a dash cam because I use one currently in her car, we share one. Um, but I needed my own one because she's going to use it in her new car. And so I just wanted to show you which one I got. We've already got a one by this brand, but we've got one that's a better one than this. I'm not, I can't remember what the numbers and codes are. We've got one that's wider and got a better camera. It's got a, like tractional speed and everything. But I just picked this one up. It was, um, I think it was 40, meant to be 45 pounds. I got some kind of a discount on it. It was like 41 pounds. But I just want to say, these are the best thing ever if you're a new driver. Get yourself a dash cam. £41, I think it was. And you can get a dash cam, 4 HD on the back. It, you, put, you basically put it on your windscreen. I took mine just behind my mirror. And um, I just plug it in. And every time I start the engine, you can you can slide it on and off from this mount. I can't do it one-handed. But you just leave everything, the wires all set up in the car. You just slide it on and off of this mount. So you just hide the camera somewhere or take it in with you. I normally take it inside with me when I take my keys out. Put it up there. Just hide it. It starts recording as soon as you start your engine. And this way, if you ever get into any kind of a car accident, you've got the video of it. And especially for young drivers, I think this is incredibly important. I've already been in an accident when I was learning to drive. My mum was hit by a drunk driver, like I said the other day. She didn't have her dash cam plugged in at the time that she did it, which was really annoying because otherwise we would have had, you know, footage of the whole thing. Or, you know, if you get hit and they drive off, you've, you've probably got this on camera. So I think it's really, really important. I just wanted to kind of say that I like this brand, Next Space. Really, really clever stuff. Um, yeah, so that's what it looks like. The screen like turns off when you drive off and stuff, but yeah. Quick shout out to that. I think I got it from Curry's and PC World or something. Oh no, I just peeled that off. I wanted to stay on there. But yeah, just wanted to give a quick shout out to that. I'm just taking the dog for a walk. 
um, this alarm going off somewhere, it's really annoying. I just changed my lipstick to the sleek matte me in, is it called like birthday suit or something? Birthday being naked, something like that. Um, yes, yeah, so I just changed it to that because I put some blue eyeliner on over the top of my black, just like a little stripe. It looks more like the whole thing's blue on camera. But yeah, just taking Tilly for a walk. Mum and Dad have just left because they've got to go to a christening this weekend up in Mid Wales. So they've headed up for that. So I've got to cook. <laughs> so um, I think we're having chicken Kievs tonight and I'll do some like pasta or something. Pasta and some veggies with it probably. I don't really like potato, well, I do like potatoes, but I don't really like cooking potatoes. I'm, I much prefer to cook pasta. I'm wearing my new bag from Accessorize. And this is the Accessorize camera bag, like so. Um, Tilly's just peeing in every spot she can and I've got my Jules wellies on, which I absolutely love. And all I need now is the um, raincoat for, from Jules that I want. And then I will have my full autumn outfit ready to go. Not really in the mood to run around. I'm going to walk her through the park and like down onto the beach, but she's just pretty slow going at the moment. I think she's a bit sad that mum and dad have gone. The park is just empty. There's, there's like someone playing on the swings, but there's no dogs or anything. This park's normally really busy, so. You have free room. So we just gone to the beach and um, I thought, I know what I'll do, I'll let the dog off, that's a good idea. What does she do? Straight in the sea, straight rolling in the sand. Stop it, you naughty dog. And now she's so playful. I'm never gonna get her back on the lead. Oh my God, what is wrong with you? Stupid move, Tasha, stupid move. Good morning. So it is now Saturday morning, I have just washed my face so my eyebrows are all like stuck down from when I washed them. Just like make them look a bit normal. I haven't got any makeup on yet cause, um, well I moisturised as well so my moisturiser is still a bit tacky. I like to like let it properly absorb before I put any makeup on. And yeah, it is a horrible day. <laughs> it has been raining. It woke me up actually. Um, I know I mentioned this quite a lot but these windows are the noisiest thing when it rains ever because the rain hits them like, you know. So you think about camping when it's raining, magnify it by like 10. The um the blinds that pull down kind of muffle it but not that much. So I woke up at like seven o'clock and um I kind of stayed in bed and then about quarter to eight I got up. Went now so I saw the dog, went to let the dog out, she was like, nah, 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 I'm not going out in that rain. And it's actually just stopped raining and I think it's meant to stop now for an hour or two. So I need to film a couple of videos, get the dog walked, and um then I can edit in the I just need to film when it's not raining. So yeah, I'm just waiting for my moisturiser to sink in. I'm watching some Ciccone Jolies. Um, I'm also burning the last of this candle from Bath & Body Works. It is the Bath & Body Works Fresh, Fresh Spring Blue Skies. It's just a little one. This is the only candle I bought back from America with me when I went two years ago. Well, a year and a half ago. That's the only candle I brought back. So yeah, I was just burning that. I've also got, actually, I've also got my electric wax melt on with one of my Melty Box things in, which multi box is one of the videos I need to film today. I'm trying to convince Matt to come and visit me at some point. I was, I, he was going to come back, he's going to come back Wednesday I think, but I was like, what if I come on Tuesday but um, I'm not allowed to be in his halls without him being there and he's got lectures but he hasn't got lectures on Wednesdays. So um, yeah, I was going to go and like hang around in his room and someone but I'm not allowed. So I'm just going to have to like, I'll go up some other time, I'll probably go up next weekend or something. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to convince him to come down. I really want to go and visit him today, but I can't because I'm on dog duty because mum and dad are away, like I said. So I work on Sundays, so Hannah has to be around to look after the dog. Like she doesn't need that much looking after, just someone to let her out and make sure she's been walked and stuff. Um, so I have to look after her today, so I can't leave her, but yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna film, I wanna film my, I've got two swatch videos I wanna film. I wanna film the swatch video for this little sleek gift set that I got, um, because I did one for the Freedom gift sets last year and that went really well, so I'm gonna do that. And I also wanna film swatches of my new NYX liquid suede lipsticks that I bought yesterday, bought the day before when they arrived yesterday. Also, I have some couple, like five or six things that I wanna do a favourites on, but I'm not sure whether I can really Qualify. As you know, I am going to do a favourites because I've just remembered something else I want to put in and that kind of makes it big enough to warrant doing. Also, I just found my very, very first camera that I started filming on um, for YouTube in general. This is the original Tasha, well, this would be Tasha Loves Nails slash maybe, yeah, it was the an, like initial Tasha Loves Beauty videos. This little camera, it doesn't actually turn on. <laughs> I think it's probably dead. It is 
it's actually a really good camera. I don't know what it is, a Samsung something. PL201. I wouldn't recommend it for filming, but for taking photos and stuff, it was really, really nice. It was like 14.2 megapixels, seven times optical zoom. Oops. But the only thing was, it had like a slight, oh, I just took a photo, it had a bit of a glitch where sometimes it would just like stop letting you take photos and you'd have to completely format the memory card for like factory reset the camera, which obviously wasn't that great. So when I went like to Belgium with school halfway through my trip, it wanted me to factory reset everything. So I couldn't do that. So I then ended up using my phone and I vlog on my phone at the moment. And obviously I film on my Canon 650D. So yeah, ramble over. Okay, so lip swatch video complete. I now have some rather raw lips. Um, and Tilly Tills still hasn't gone outside today. And she will most certainly be needing a wee, maybe even a poo. So I'm gonna now force her to go outside. Just open the curtains. I've just like thrown her outside and she won't. She's just like, let me back in. Is it a bit wet? Let me back in. No, mm -mm. not until you go for a wee. So Hannah and I have just come out for lunch and um, she's got a chocolate milkshake and I've got a latte, which I'm really looking forward to and we've ordered some food as well, so just waiting for that. So this is our lunch, we both got the same thing and I'm really hungry. Okay, so I've just got, we just got back for the meal and um, I just wanted to quickly show my outfit because I actually really liked it. So I've got this top on that I was wearing earlier from Primark. Leather jacket's really old from Primark as well, but these jeans are from ASOS. They are the Ridley Lisbon ones. And um, I've got my little boots from New Look that are new and I love them, except they're really tight across the toes. So I'm just trying to kind of wear them in. And I've got my new bag from ASOS. This is the ASOS camera bag in the blue shade and I just thought it looked like I just thought it looked quite cool and um I really love these boots and they are like the perfect height that they're super easy to walk in but they still give me three and a half inches of height so I like them <laughs> okay so I can't remember the last time I vlogged but um Hannah and I went and took the dog for a lovely walk down the beach and it was lovely and nice and um now i'm just going to co-op but we just opened the freezer we're basically we're looking for we're having pizzas for dinner and we we're just like oh we'll just check what we've got in the freezer because i was going to go and buy some open the freezer someone put a can of coke in there and it's exploded and gone everywhere so there's coke all over the floor now because when i opened it all the like slush fell out coke all over the inside of the freezer so i'm not looking forward to cleaning that out so i'm going to go and get my dinner put it on and then whilst it's cooking i'm going to clean okay so for dinner i just attempted to make chicken ramen <laughs> um, it actually looked horrible when I first made it, but it looks all right now. It's kind of going on. I just really hope it's still warm. The chicken's still warm and everything's warm. But yeah, yum, yum, yum. So, good morning, guys. I am just walking to work. I've just had a text saying my ASOS delivery is going to be delivered to me. Um, it's absolutely freezing. I woke up and it was 12 degrees in my room. And now, yeah, I had to put the heating on in the car and everything. Yeah, so just passed someone who now thinks I'm an absolute fruitcake for walking and filming myself. But yeah, so off to work. Okay, so hello, welcome to later in the day. Um, really busy day at work. It was so annoying. I was just like, <sighs> and we were like understaffed as well. But um, yeah, so I have had dinner. I've come home. I need to wash my hair. It doesn't look too bad, but it's like I know it'll be bad in the morning. I won't have time to wash my hair in the morning. I um have just been like stressing out I don't I don't know why I just needed like my room was just cluttered and annoying me so I have just been going through all of my clothing getting like taking out all the summer stuff that I can put away because I don't know if anyone else does this I don't know anyone else that does this outside my family I have like all my summer clothes like I'll put out in the summer and then the winter I'll put them in a box in the attic <laughs> anyone else do that is it just me because I hate my drawers being like really full it just really annoys me so I, I have to like segregate my clothes Obviously there's some things that I keep out all year round, but um, yeah, I'm like taking all my summer stuff out so I can make room for the winter stuff because I was cold today. Like it was cold at work and tomorrow at work we're like cleaning. So I need to make sure I've got some like old clothes. So I was also trying to clean out this so I could find some old clothes to wear to do the cleaning in tomorrow. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what's happening 
it wasn't as much. The only piles, this pile here and this pile here are just like some of the stuff I found so far. I haven't gone through. I've only done one drawer on my rack at the moment. I need to do like the other two drawers. Although I don't think there'll be as much in there because the other one's like my underwear and pyjamas and then my bottoms, like my trousers. So I don't think there'll be that much in those two. But um, yeah, so that's what I've been doing. Um, I also have been watching the new In The Fro unboxing. I actually really love her ASOS hauls. Like every time I watch them, I'm like, right, I want that. And I go to find it and it's always out of stock because she just like, everyone, I feel like she just makes everything go out of stock when she shows them in her hauls. It's so annoying. Also, I got this really cool just nudged the table as I was walking and it's just knocked everything off. I was, I um got an ASOS order today with two dresses um, for when I go and visit Matt so I can wear them when I go like if we go out clubbing because I've not, I've not really got anything to wear. Um, I got this weird perfume sample. You like pull out this tag. You pull out this tag and then you squeeze it. Like I don't know if you can see there's like a little, I just thought it was a really cool thing. I haven't taken it out because I'm actually going to try it out tomorrow I think but um yeah, so that was a really weird way to do a perfume sample. Like normally you get like the little bottles and they've got the little spray or just like the little thing you just pour onto your hand. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm doing. I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this week's vlog. I'm catching up with them slowly but steadily. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.